Bob Johnson with BK and W Model Works coming at you with another video. Today I'm coming to you from 24 hours of Saginaw, a rail fanning event, and I'll have another video about this in the future. But today's video is about the colors and the color scheme for the boxcars for my freelance model railroad. Now one of the fun things about having your own railroad is that you can pick your own colors. Uh oh, it's Texas wind, it's pretty strong. You can pick your own colors, your own herald, and your own uh, design of your uh, color scheme on your locomotives and your rolling stock. The Pohoi Karakara and Western has an orange, blue, and white scheme uh, as befitting its Gulf Coast setting. The orange is for the sun, the white is for the sand of the Gulf Coast, and the blue is for the water, or the sky, or both. But, sorry about that. But how those colors are arranged in the model is another story. So here are my three proposed schemes for uh, decorating 50-foot boxcars, and I'd like you to vote in the comments on which one you think is best. So this first scheme is uh, predominantly the orange color of the railroad. That is um, Go Mango, the Mopar color, also a good match for Adams. Mega Blast Orange in the Montana Black line of paint. Here's number two, which has a white stripe down the center of the car. It might be a bit of a masking challenge, but I can see how that would match up very well with a similar stripe on a locomotive. And here is C, the third option, which is half the car divided in half, one half orange, one half white. So, again, here they are, A, B, C. If you could give me your vote in the comments, I'd really appreciate it. Let me know if you think these are too similar to existing railroads. Maybe they're too old-fashioned because this is supposed to be a modern railroad. Let me know what you think. Until next time, Bob Johnson at DK&W Model Works signing off. Keep on modeling.